Hi, it's Ian from CADSpace. I'd like to quickly show you how you can use your shortcut toolbars to improve your efficiency in SOLIDWORKS. The shortcut toolbars are accessed using the S key on the keyboard. So here I am in a sketch, hitting the S key brings up a dialog box on the end of the mouse, which contains a lot of the commonly used sketch tools. We can add more features to this toolbar by simply right-clicking and using the Customize option. Here we can see there are actually four different toolbars. One for sketch, one for drawings, one for assemblies and one for parts. And we can drag and drop features or commands from any of the toolbars listed on the left-hand side here. So, in my sketch toolbar I'm going to add some features. So I'll go into my features toolbar, I can simply drag the extruded boss and also the extruded cut into my sketch toolbar. Also in the part toolbar I'm going to add the shell command. So here in our sketch S for shortcut brings up the uh, option to use the line straight away, uh, generating the, uh, the lines around this background sketch. Again, S for shortcut, we can go straight to our circle command. S for shortcut goes to our smart dimension. Let's type value in. And now S for shortcut gives us the option of going straight to our extruded boss without having to exit the sketch or go back up to the menus. So here we can extrude our shape to, um, to any thickness and OK. Now we're in the, uh, in the part itself. S on the keyboard brings up the part shortcut toolbar and here we added the shell command. So by taking out these four faces and OK, we can create a, th a shelled feature directly. So hopefully that helps in, uh, in increasing your speed and productivity in SOLIDWORKS. Remember to use the S key on the keyboard and we can right click on those toolbars to customize and add more functionality to our shortcut toolbars. Thanks for watching and I hope that helped.